POLITICAL FACE-OFF AS THE RACE FOR MAYOR HEATS UP TODAY. CANDIDATE NATHAN FLACHER RELEASED AN ATTACK AD TARGETING CARL DEMAYO. THE FIRST NEGATIVE AD IS NOW CIRCULATING THE INTERNET WITH TWO MONTHS LEFT UNTIL THE ELECTION. THIS JUST OVER A WEEK AFTER ASSEMBLYMAN FLETCHER ANNOUNCED HIS SWITCH FROM REPUBLICAN TO INDEPENDENT. 10 NEWS REPORTER PRESTON PHILLIPS IS LIVE IN CORONADO WITH THE ACCUSATIONS BEING MADE AGAINST HIS OPPONENT. PRESTON? Yeah, and Ken, this also comes just days after Nathan Fletcher called Carl DeMaio out in front of hundreds at a mayoral candidates forum last week in Hillcrest, accusing Carl DeMaio's attacks and saying his attacks cost him the Republican endorsement. In this ad posted here on YouTube, it accuses Carl DeMaio for failing to give San Diegans the answers to several key questions related to his candidacy. We actually did not anticipate that question. In this newly released online attack ad, Nathan Fletcher accuses Carl DeMaio of refusing to answer several questions, like did you meet with lobbyists behind closed doors? Why did you try and defund the City Ethics Commission after they find you? What is your stance on SB 48? The ad has relevance because there are certain issues that Councilman DeMaio should be addressing. With this ad, political science professor Carl Luna thinks Fletcher is trying to battle DeMaio for the moderate Republican votes that may still exist. He has to be Careful, he doesn't alienate moderate independents and moderate Democrats. In response to Fletcher's ad, DeMaio's campaign released this statement to 10 News. This attack is taken directly from the Government Labor Union website. While Nathan Fletcher and his Government Labor Union backers resort to desperate political games, Carl DeMaio will continue to talk about solving San Diego's fiscal problems and how we can all work together to reform the pension system. Carl DeMaio is going to downplay the content of the ad and try to turn it against Nathan Fletcher, saying he's going to take the higher. Road. You may remember when Fletcher called DeMaio out of the LGBT mayoral candidate forum in Hillcrest last week, claiming DeMaio cost him the Republican endorsement by viciously attacking him on social issues while running as a Republican. DeMaio's response garnered boos from the crowd. People could also be heard yelling liar. I have never criticized any of my opponents for the position of for Carl DeMaio to say he's never attacked any of his opponents is for like the New Orleans Saints to say that they've never paid anybody to put a hit on someone on the front after the whistle's blown.